Hi everyone, you're watching Sorbside video blog and today I'll tell you about our side audit feature. Site audit is an important step of every optimization process. It finds errors on your website that prevent you from ranking higher. So if you want to rank higher in organic search, we recommend that you start with site audit. So let me show you how it works in SERPstat. At the beginning you have to set two parameters, number of threads and number of pages you want to check. The number of pages is limited by your plan and the number of threads is the number of simultaneous requests that our robots will send to your website. Make sure to check your server settings, because the number of threads set to high may trigger your provider's security systems and we won't be able to finish the audit. Once the audit is over, you will see a screen similar to this one. It shows you how well your website is optimized. The SDO score is our internal parameter. We calculate it by counting the number of errors on your website and how critical they are. Next to the SDO score, you will see a list of errors uh, sorted by their priority, along with the total number of errors. By clicking on that schedule, you can uh, set the audit to repeat automatically every day, every week, and so on. And also, if you want to track your progress and compare your score to the previous audit, you can click at the bottom and select the date. We have the following eight groups of errors in our audit. HTTP status code, meta tags, headings, redirects, accessibility and indexation, links, server parameters, and loading speed. By clicking on a certain group of errors, you will see a detailed report. For example, let's take a look at the meta tags report. As you can see, the errors here are sorted by priority. The errors with high priority are always on top. By clicking on the error, you will see the description of it and the recommendations on how to get rid of it. By clicking on more details, you will see how often that error was found on your website, how it looks like, and also by clicking on the number of errors, you will see the links to the pages that have this error. It works similarly for the errors in other groups. You can click on the group, see the list of errors, click on the errors, see the description, uh, the recommendations for getting rid of it, and also the detailed info about the error, the links, the numbers, and so on. So go ahead and try our audit, subscribe to our channel, follow us on social media, and uh, thank you for watching. Have a good one. Bye.